Hey everybody, how's it going? Today we're gonna play something a little different. Not a guardian, but Apwash. Apwash is one of those gods that like I feel like people people see him and he's kind of underrated, you know? And I just I just want to play him, especially because there's so many gods in the meta that Apwash is actually really good against. Uh for example, what do you do? Know? Soul. Soul is being played like crazy right now. Soul and Ola Run. And Apwash kinda counters them because of their their heal. So, yeah, no, it's, it's amazing. Uh, we are going to go into a gem for the late game movement speed gem into a Kronos pen immediately. And we're going to get some potions and we need to leave base immediately so I can place some corpses at blue buff. In fact, I'm already a little bit late. I watch it's very important to leave as soon as you can so that we can get some corpses going. Okay, let's go get that. Pick this up. Oh, I didn't mean to pick that one up. That's all right. Actually, that might work out a little bit better because now my cooldowns for for red a little bit faster. Yeah, actually, picking up that three corpses is uh, quite quite a bit better. Yeah, okay. I meant to pick that one up too, but okay. All right. Yeah, today I woke up. I wasn't really feeling too well, so my voice sounds a little bit different. It's about that. Sorry. Uh, yeah, we're going to try to get this, this game either way, though, because I, I can't talk. I feel well enough to do that. Mannequins, as expected on Soul. That's all right. Okay, if my three was up, I would go for her now. But we need max cooldown so that we can do that every time. Damn, I missed. We should go for a speed buff. I think after this wave. Yeah, let's go for her speed. Because she's kind of playing a little bit far back, and I just want to, you know, get get ahead. One way or another. And I think I do a lot on Outpost. You'll notice I, is I use my 1-2 for explosion. And then I'll pick up the 3 for the cooldowns. Because if you don't know, Outpost passive, basically whenever he picks up a corpse, lowers the cooldown of his 1 and 2. It also gives him percent health and percent mana back. Good stuff. It actually does a lot of damage too. That was not good. And she basically has to wait forever just to use her th her one to heal. Let's go take uh, my speed as well. Where are you going? I already took that. Where are you going? This place is cursed. Yeah, I tried to record uh, uh, some other Guardians today, but it, it wasn't going so well. So I was like, yeah, we'll just get a different God for today, and then I'll try again tomorrow. What I used to do was I used to just try recording a bunch of games, and if it obviously wasn't working, I would just not upload. But no, I'm not doing that this time around. That's that's how I always get demotivated, you know what I mean? Like I have a bunch of weird games, and I decide for whatever reason that not to upload it. Um... And then all of a sudden it's like, then I feel bad for not uploading it. It's like a cycle. And we're not doing that. So instead we're just going to play God that I feel like doesn't get played enough. I don't really think Outwash is like scummy. Like, I, I don't know if people consider him scummy. I don't think he is. I think he just counters uh, some of the top tier gods. While, you know, if he fights a god without healing, he's not like crazy good. I mean, he doesn't really have mobility either. He hard counters Chiron, by the way, because every time Chiron uses an ability, Chiron heals, so he's getting stunned. That healing we have. That should be fine.
She doesn't have too much healing outside of her one, quite honestly. Her blue buff is coming up right now as well. Yeah, she's trying to auto-attack my corpses uh, before they explode. So that means that I just need to time my 1-2 better. Usually I like to wait a little bit so that the wave's closer together. But if she's autoing it, I have to make sure to get it off, you know. I get the ability off before one of the corpses disappears. This is also one of my favorite skins. I love it. It's a special emote, too. It's harvesting time! You know, it's not quite Halloween, but hey, if people could celebrate Christmas like three months early, I could celebrate Halloween. Uh, just about as much time early. Oh, hello. Oh, I might be dead. Unless she gets scared. She got scared, thank goodness. Oh, talk about jump scare. All right, we are also going to go into, oh, what was the the item? Spear of the Mages? Yeah, Spear of the Mages. None will be spared. I was trying this build on stream yesterday, but I, instead I rushed Spear of the Mages. I think, I, I've been just trying a bunch of different things uh, lately. I think rushing Spear of the Mages was actually better, uh, but I don't, I won't, don't actually know. I haven't tried it enough times. I just know the full cooldown on that wash is when you get st stupid strong. Because then, if your opponent is near you, you're just constantly exploding corpses and they're taking too much damage. If they're not, I mean, you're healing way too much health. More health than anyone should be. Uh-oh. A soul ulting the wave. Who would have thought? I need to be using my three on her as well. Even my one. My one applies on that heal. Where did my corpses go on my one? Yeah, I, I'm gonna have to look back at that. I, I that was confusing. Like I used my ability and they weren't next to me, and they also weren't where I shot them. So where did they go? That's all right. Your middle tower is under attack. That's all right. She does have Hecate. That's kind of annoying, but it shouldn't be too much of a problem. We're still going to hold off on our defense for now. She's probably going to take her speed buff, and then she's going to recall. I kind of want to get a bunch of movement speed as well. So we're going to go Talisman of Energy into the upgraded the movement speed gem and i think that should be enough with uh sh shield of regrowth if i really want to shield of regrowth is better than i remember it being. whoops like you can proc it like almost all the time there's like a two seconds of downtime missing my abilities whoops stuff good stuff i actually had a, a corpse already set up there which was nice and now we can do hop wash things now this this part is a little bit scubby where you're basically just picking up all the corpses feeling to full health but it's just a part of this kit She can build anti-heal if she wants to. Place a ward in the middle of lane so we know if she's following or not. It looks like she's following, but from the right side. I should be able to take this before she gets over here. Now, will she follow me to blue buff is the question. I just heard her. Yeah, she is. No, she's not. Okay. Where'd she go? Did she recall? She might have recalled. Whoops. 
All right, let's back up. Let's back up. Oh, did I not pick up the buff? Whoops. I meant to pick up red. I guess I'll pick up blue. Max cooldown's actually better right now. Uh, this would put me at 30%. Okay, let's go talisman. Talisman of energy, and let's get some wards. And let's get a... Oh, I don't know what to get. Second relic. Um, we get a sunder for her shell. Maybe a, a sprint. So that she can't slow me. I can dodge her ultimate easily. Maybe I can get a shell myself. That's not a bad idea. We can think about it. We're not really under any pressure to get a relic right now, right now. I think Blink actually might be awesome. Blink out wash with the alt. It's not uh, conventional, but it's definitely fun. Now we're doing a lot more damage. Unfortunately, it's kind of hard to poke Phoenix because if I hit her with any sort of dot, it's going to make the Phoenix target me. Now we can just heal. Yeah, we still need a little bit of blue. Good, I hit her. That's really good. She is chasing me, but she's not fast enough. You gotta be quicker than that. <laughs> gotta be quicker than that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, whoops. That's not gonna get her, but it'll give me cooldowns. There we go. <laughs> Damn, we are. We're getting speedy. We're getting speedy, speedy. Uh, we could try to go for Phoenix here. I'd like red buff, though. Upgraded red. Our corpses are healing us for 142 a pop. Yeah, another build you can go on up wash is you can instead go like a health mana build where each corpse is just healing you so much more she did get pestilence but i'm most of my healing is out of range that is gonna stun her can chill over there. Oh, I didn't, I didn't even realize. She has double defense. I wonder if she's so tanky. So if I want, I can probably get some some that. Some more pen or something of this sort. Oh, she might kill me here. I, I'm, I drastically overestimated uh, my cooldowns. I only have 20% cooldown right now. Not even close to 40%. But we are alive. Uh, you know what? I kind of want the movement speed. Doesn't give pen, but we're going to be so speedy. Plus, it gives cooldown. We're going to be so fast. Look at this. Zoom. Whenever we're in trouble, we can just walk away. I wonder if she's in trouble, I can just walk up next to her. And with blue buff, we now have 40% cooldown, so now we can actually see the strength of proper upwash. Late game, uh, we won't need blue buff. Instead, we'll have the power potion. I guess next item, I mean, it's kind of weird to go Karen's coin at this point. Uh, but she is going double defense, and I think Obsidian is terrible in upwash because it, it procs on his one instead of the two. And you really don't need the extra pen on the one. So Karen's coin, even though I usually don't build a duel, I think it is better here. Oh, is she really just going to give me this Phoenix? Yes, she is. That, that was weird. She's going to get stunned by that.
we're doing quite a bit of damage because she has double defense. Quite a bit. And now we just fully heal. <laughs> now we just fully heal. And we are full health and mana and ready to fight again. Who needs who needs a recall? Yeah, I'd say Soul is a lot higher on the tier list than that Posh as well. It's just... It's, oh, the Titan stock. Man, I, I actually really enjoy this map. I know some people don't, and I'm sorry if you do not enjoy the map. I will be perfectly happy or perfectly fine when it rotates just because so many people don't enjoy it. But the most... The thing I hate about it is the Titan AI. The Titan, Titan AI is terrible. I thought they fixed it, but no. It's, it's actually worse than before. Okay, I'm actually dying. Might be dead. <laughs> but I got her! There we go. I was only able to get that because of my move speed. That's the funny part. Oh my goodness. She, she was mitigating so much too. It's kind of funny. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll be sure to get a Guardian game tomorrow. I think Emoja. Uh, I think we'll be playing Emoja tomorrow. I just... Eh, the games I was trying, like, for one reason or another, I just had problems with them. Like, I believe one of the recordings I tried to do, I realized I wasn't even recording, so I just kind of F6'd and got into the next game. And there we go. Appreciate you guys watching. Uh, and, yeah, uh, let me know what God... You would like me to play next time? I, 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 as you guys may have noticed, I think my favorite gods are unconventional gods. Gods that you usually don't see in duel. So those are probably the best suggestions. And uh, yeah. Although, although maybe we'll play some higher tier gods at some point just so that, you know. Because I can play them. I can play the higher tiers. I just don't enjoy playing them as much. And here's the match details. And I'll see you guys next time.